Hello and welcome to this Skiller broadcast. Uh, my name is Simon Whittemore from Skiller and um, today I have with me one of the senior management members from Falk Renewables, uh, an interesting company that is really going places at the moment and as you'll hear quite appropriate for the week of the climate summit COP26. Um, let me introduce uh, firstly Luisa de la Monica who is the Global Learning and Talent Manager for Falk Renewables. Uh, we're going to speak a bit about the collaboration between Skiller and Falk Renewables. So can I start with a fairly general question, if I may, Louisa, just about the sort of background to the project and, and the background to Falk so that we can understand a bit about the, um, the organisation, where you've come from, the change that you've come through to what you are now, uh, very much focused on renewables, environmentally friendly, etc um environmentally beneficial not just friendly um and uh, also where does the skinner project fit into that bigger picture of falc yes um of course we are an international poor player uh, we are specialized in the field of renewable energies which develops design uh, builds and manages plants that generate clean energy our mission uh, is also our driver because it consists in creating shared and lasting value for all our stakeholders. Mm. And uh, we would like, of course, to respect the environment that surrounds us. Mm. Um, in sustainability, we also, of course, have the attention to our human capital. That's why yeah. uh, Skila is, is connected. OK, fine. Thank you very much. That's excellent. So, I mean, maybe we can then uh, look at what the uh, overall sort of training plans are in the overall development plans do you have for, for your human resources in Falk Renewables um, and, and say how uh, Skinner came into that. It is very important to uh, commit people uh, to promote continuous learning. Uh, mm. So in our ever changing environment and most of all in, in, this, uh, in this last period, um, it means to constantly support people and support their potential to grow. Um, so we make training as a key element in the development of our employees, of our people, and we believe in their potential to, to develop themselves. Yeah. So we organize upskilling and reskilling programs. Um, we prepare uh, programs that are also involve directly colleagues as teachers and trainers uh, to share their know-how. Uh, yeah. And also we um, we use training as a um, as a tool to connect people. So um, what is very important for us in structuring the learning program is to give uh, the, the right attention, so to care, the needs, uh, technical cross-managerial language courses uh, that could, uh, could be important for people. Uh, coaching, mentoring, uh, internal knowledge sharing, as I said before, and also internal courses um, with external partners um, are very, uh, very good for us. Pila is uh, one of the tools that we use um, to allow continuous learning. Yeah, so and, and just from a, a, a corporate point of view, thinking about Falk as a learning organisation, it's a slightly different question, but I, if I'm right, you have some sort of enablers that you highlight. Inside our organisation, we have launched uh, um, some years ago uh, behaviours, of course, to be acted, and these behaviours are our uh, managerial skills, so our way to live our company environment and our way to manage um, our day by day um, working life uh, yeah. inside our company. If we come back down to the project of the Skiller collaboration and the Skiller work, I have to ask you that, you know, $64 million question, why Skiller? We have decided to, to use Skilla because of um, its broad learning portfolio and because the methodology, as you, you have understood, I give uh, a lot of importance to the methodology too. Yeah. Because um, I think that Skilla is uh, effective. It has um, different training modules, but they are pragmatic. They are straight to the point and they have different stimulus inside um, and also uses humor that it's very important because you you can learn 
just having fun and so there is also the emotional involvement of people while learning. This is um, fundamental in um, a precise uh, goal that we have. Uh, that's the one of approaching uh, micro learning. We live a dynamic, yeah. a fast environment, so we need to yeah. learn quickly uh, and to apply immediately. We use Skilla as an individual tool. As I said before, we give a lot of importance to the individual um, ability to care for uh, one's yeah. development. Yeah. On the other side, it's very important to use Skilla as a collaborative learning tool. Uh, we have created and launched uh, a project uh, that is called Just in Time Learning. Mm -hmm. And this project is interesting before uh, because it um, uh, it allows people to uh, learn together uh, yeah. so they, they can attend a, a training model together in the same meeting mm -hmm. at the same time. But um, they can also uh, have uh, this, um, this training model separately and then meet and share their learning insights and exploit this moment in order to also ex share, uh, uh, exchange experiences, uh, feedbacks and of course, as I said before, now we, we give importance to connect people. Absolutely understood, yeah. Um, so you've got the two sides of the individual responsibility Yes. for one's learning and the other side of the collaborative assurance and the connection between people which is really uh, obviously a strong point of, uh, of Falk Renewables um, you know it's not a case of here's these fantastic learning resources get on with it but I think you know we always say that the communication and learning strategy built around our resources which are designed to be very flexible and as you say micro learning multimedia and the flexibility around that the, sorry the structure and the strategy around that is vital to to give people the best chance for those courses to become an enabler as well. So hopefully we're we're one of the enablers now in your yes. organization. Uh, that, that, that would be nice to think so anyway. Um, OK, so the last question I have, if that's all right, Louisa, is just to talk a bit about the future. What are your plans in terms of training development in the organization as far as the Skillers project concerned and, and beyond? Yeah, um, of, of course, we would like to, to keep on uh, going um, towards this uh, this goal. Um, so the, the goal of giving people this opportunity to continuous learning, continuous development, having also fun. Um, uh, this allows us to to care about their engagement too, not only about their competencies or performance. Yeah. Uh, Skilla helps a lot in this because uh, having a pragmatic approach and a very uh, immediate uh, approach, yeah. giving also techniques and giving uh, different stimulus, yeah. uh, you can uh, practic practically find uh, an application inside your day by day uh, working life. Well, uh, sounds marvellous. I'm, I'm enthused and, uh, you know, wish you all the best for Falk uh, Renewables uh, going forward, really, in the future, uh, which is already upon us. Um, <laughs> and uh, I think it, it just remains for me to say thank you very much for joining us, Louisa. And uh, it's, it's a pleasure in this collaboration for us in Skiller to collaborate with Falk and long way at last. Yeah, thank you very much to you. Uh, it has been a great opportunity to share our experience that's fundamental for, for learning. So yeah. thank you a lot again. Pleasure. Thanks, Louisa. Thanks.